Tonight at 10, we take a look back at some of the major developments made over the past year in Panama City Beach. Plus, residents in a local county won't have to travel far for their health care needs anymore because plans for a new hospital are coming to the area. And we'll meet some very unique people that can only really celebrate their birthdays once every four years. Live from WJHG, this is News Channel 7 at 10. Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us. I'm Lisa Wilkins. And I'm Barry Lowen. Welcome to News Channel 7 at 10. Two men were arrested this week after investigators say they were trying to sneak contraband into a prison using a drone. Jackson County Sheriff's deputies were patrolling the area near Appalachian Correctional Institute when they noticed a vehicle parked in the middle of the road. Upon approaching the vehicle, they noticed the smell of marijuana and heard a drone flying overhead. Deputies also noticed that one of the men was operating the drone with the controller in his hand. Four suspects were detained, including Mario White, the operator of the drone, and Jamarius Brandt, who was driving the car. Deputies searched the vehicle and found tobacco products, suboxone strips, bath salts, and a few grams of marijuana. The drone was located nearby with a bag attached to it. Inside, deputies found a white powdery substance, cell phones, and other contraband. The two men were arrested for introducing contraband into a correctional facility. White was also charged with possession of a controlled substance. We've all heard the State of the Union speech given by the president, but as News Channel 7's Austin Maida tells us, sometimes those addresses are even more localized.